Hi, Libra Anarchy here. Um, yeah, I'm sick, and I want to wish everyone happy holidays, for one. And some people who have made some videos, uh, I know Bespoke Group made one about basically getting over yourself and just enjoying the season. And, you know, of course you have the Christian, some Christians saying, oh, it's it's Christmas, it's not holiday, there's a war on Christmas, oh my god. And then you'll have fucking... Okay, so my glasses are annoying me. Then you have these people who are like fucking... Don't, you know, don't put your religion in my face, bah humbug, da 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 And you have people that are like, oh, it's all about consumerism. Or, oh, the Christians stole the solstice from the pagans, da 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 and you have people trying to be in a bad mood about it and just lighten up. Yeah, um, you know, I'm with you there. And another friend of mine who made a private video, his videos are private now because his channel gets, well, a lot of harassment. It's not just trolling, it's to the point of genuine harassment, so he posts private videos. Anyway, so he talked about the holiday and how he doesn't like that what should be a family thing and a happy time hi cat has been turned into you know sort of a corporate consumerist season it's turned into buy crap day hi Sunny, how you doing hey Sunny. hi so yeah <laughs> see the cat's more interesting than I'll ever be right so, there's his butt. <laughs> so, um, what was I talking about? Shit. <laughs> this is a fucking cat video now. There's his tail. Oh my fucking god! It's a cat tail! Oh! Where'd you go? Oh, you're gonna get in a box. Cool. Hi, Seti. This is Seti. Hey, Seti. Yeah. You're a long cat, aren't you? Seti's a long cat. Seti's a long cat. Yeah. Yeah, I think I was going to rain about Christmas and how every year a news story will come out about, you know, some city hall will pay for a nativity scene on, on their lawn and people don't like it. And, yeah, I don't like that, you know, tax money is going to a stupid nativity scene. But, you know, given the nature of what government is, a mystical institution, yeah, they're going to, you know fun stuff like that with money they extorted from you. But then, you know, people who don't like it, they'll put up a plaque. They'll pay to have a plaque put up that says, There probably is no God. Fine. And then the Jewish people want something, some kind of menorah or something like that put up. So, have a Jewish organization paying to put that up. Um, and then you'll have some kind of group that says, oh, let's do something for Solstice or Yule or something like that, and they'll put up that. And then you'll have some other organization wanting to put up something silly, like about the flying spaghetti monster. Uh, you know, and then of course, you know, you'll have Muslims and stuff wanting to get in on things. So, yeah, and, you know, think, you know, it'll get kind of ridiculous, and then of course there, there is the fake war on Christmas, as I already mentioned. Yeah. <laughs> See, the cat's are more interesting than I am, so that's what I'm going to fucking show you while I talk. Right? And it occurs to me, why not just put this shit on your lawn? Like, why would uh, any group of Christians or even just City Hall decide, let's pay to l display something in the middle of the city about one particular myth?
about the sun returning. Because, you know, our myth about the baby sun being our savior, because, you know, without heat and light we would die, is better than another person's myth. You know, Jesus is better than Horus, is better than, what, Mithra or something? Fucking hell. Yeah, yeah let's just fucking, yeah. Why don't we just call it fucking Nuclear Fusion Day and get on with it? I don't know. Fucking hell. Sorry about all this. Yeah, I got a PM talking about... Goddamn. Talking about my fucking camera. This is a horrible video. <laughs> this is the worst video I've ever done. <laughs> I, I guess my point in all this would be like, uh, why can't we just have a fucking, you know, why can't we just say happy fucking whatever the fuck you celebrate, you know, like Chris Mahana Kwanzaa and, and just get on with it. And why can't people just put the displays in their own goddamn yards and then you have a neighborhood that's... You know, you have a nativity scene in one yard and another yard. Maybe they do something silly like have the flying spaghetti monster. Maybe in another yard they'll have some kind of Kwanzaa display or something. But it's not. it doesn't look tacky anymore. People intentionally know what they're doing. Unless they decide that they're going to compete with their neighbors or something. But it just seems like, why don't people just kind of, you know decorate their own yards and celebrate whatever it is they want to fucking celebrate and the people saying bah humbug well that's fine but why just if if you're not in the christmas spirit just don't be in the christmas spirit and if you're like you don't like all the fucking corporatist bullshit then fucking don't buy into the corporatist bullshit and have a very you know, modest holiday. One of the dumbest things I've ever seen come down the pipe was buy nothing day. And all you gotta do to fight commercialism is on Black Friday, buy nothing. Wow, I'm so important. I'm such a revolutionary. I can sit in my house and not go shopping that day. I hate Black Friday. I never go shopping on Black Friday. I did shopping on Cyber Monday, but that's because I can do it in my goddamn house and I'm not going to get fucking trampled. There you go. But goddamn. Do nothing day. Don't even get me started on that shit. That, ugh, God. Here's a thought. Just don't go fucking shopping on Black Friday and don't fucking delude yourself into thinking it's a fucking movement. coffee. Okay, and uh, if you're familiar with sand turkey, that's another stupid one. I have more respect for that than Black Friday, because at least it is more than getting at, than just sitting in, in your house. But basically, sand turkey is another anti-consumerist movement, and basically people dress up like Santa and go break shit. I don't know how this stops people from consuming. I don't know how you can stop people from consuming. We're all fucking consumers. We're all fucking producers. Okay? Now, if you are anti-consumerism in, in the point that you don't like the idea of people being measured by their net worth, fine. How does breaking stuff change that, okay? I think Santarchy is fucking stupid, but at least it's better than Buy Nothing Day. I just, it's like, all the dumbasses looking for excuses to be offended decide to fucking be offended. <laughs> like, fucking hell, lighten up. And so, yeah, and, I mean, would I like to see, do I like to see nativity scenes on courthouse lawns. Well, no, but it's not the end of the fucking world. If I'm so fucking irritated, I can take some time to go read or listen to some atheist material or something like that. Or I can actually learn about different 
death and resurrection myths, or I can, you know, fucking, maybe I can write, you know, hell, I can make a video saying here's what, you know, I don't see the evidence for <laughs> the Judeo-Christian God or something like that, or, or I could write a, a letter to some fundamentalist preacher saying, oh, just to let you know, this is what you're doing. Now, I wouldn't do that because I would have to give my return address and I don't want to buy a P.O. box just to write to a fundamentalist preacher, but you can always do something if you're that upset about something. <laughs> Fortunately, we're not in North Korea yet, or in um, Islamabad somewhere yet. <laughs> I don't know. Was, um, or, or here's a better here's a better comparison. We're not in Mecca yet, where you have to be Muslim even to enter the city. My point is, we are not yet a theocracy, or or the Republic of Jericho, which is out of fiction, but yeah. So, instead of getting all butthurt about random stuff that happens around this time of year, why not just, you know, do what makes you happy? You, you don't like corporatism? Fucking fine. Neither do I. So have a fucking, have a modest holiday. Have, you know, sa save your money and make your holiday far less about the stuff and more like everyone gets one or two presents and everyone shares a meal and everyone does some some fun activity together that day. Fuck, even a board game or something is is better than making Christmas all about how much stuff we can acquire, right? Or, you know, make a family tradition about, you know, making beer or something. Brew, brew some yold beer. That's what you ought to do. Do that. Yeah. <laughs> You know, if you're up north or there's snow, go sledding on Christmas. I mean, shit, you don't have to... Christmas doesn't have to be consumerist day if you don't want it to be. So I guess the whole point of this is complaining doesn't do much good. Being a grouch doesn't do much good. What does more good is just fucking making decisions to do something in accordance with your own desires rather than complaining about what other people do. So that's my two cents and I'm done with this video. Have a nice day. I'm... I don't know. I'm scatterbrained today. Fuck it. <laughs> what I wonder is who's actually gonna watch this to the end?